talk about a hat. It is the Pratt hat from Clinton Hill Cashmere. I had a knit along with Clinton Hill Cashmere leading up to my 40th birthday and I had this skein of worsted weight left over. It wasn't a full skein. It was like three quarters of a skein and I'm going, oh, what am I going to do with just this small skein of yarn? And she said, just make a hat. So the hat pattern that she sent me uses up a full skein of the worsted and I knew I didn't have enough, but I thought, you know what, let me just see how far I can go with this hat. So this is a modified Pratt hat. And the main modification is just that as you're decreasing here, you can see how it kind of rounds over like this. Can you see that? Can, can you see it? <laughs> it's decreasing here. So if I were to, to have done the full pattern, I would have decreased more, like maybe all the way to here. So it kind of, sits off your head a little bit and what's interesting about this cashmere is that it really does grow so even when i finished i i, I used every last bit of the yarn as I, I knit as far as i could so even before i blocked it it was fitting and then after i blocked it it grew just enough so it still fits exactly like the pratt hat is supposed to fit so I'm obsessed with this hat. In fact, it actually has grown more since I've been wearing it around a lot because it kind of stretches to your head a little bit. <gasps> I love my cashmere hat. It's so nice to have on your head. And it's a very straightforward pattern. And it's nice when a designer customizes the pattern to exactly go with the yarn because especially when you're buying cashmere, it's such a special thing to buy. It's expensive and worth it because it feels so nice but you want to use up every last bit of that yarn so the Pratt hat I know will go perfectly with that one skein of worsted weight because this modified one still works I showed these pom-poms in a sash position video weeks ago but I just thought I would show them to you here I love this hat by itself but I recently discovered these pom-poms at M&J trimming in the city which is Located near Bryant Park. So if you're ever coming to New York City and you want to do like a yarn crawl or anything else like that, put this on your list because there's so many great trimmings and button shops in the city and M&J is one of my favorite ones. Like if you can only go to one, definitely go there because Bryant Park is such a wonderful neighborhood, one of my favorites. And M&J is right just a few blocks away. They have patches, pins, ribbons, buttons, just anything you can think of, they have it. And I had never seen these before. So I had seen the pom-poms that have the snap where you sew one side of the snap here and then you snap it on and off so you can wash your hat, even though I don't really wash my hats. But these have a pin. So they're like an enamel pin. I still have a, a tag on here. Okay, so see this pin right there? Yeah, it just comes off and attaches to the hat. I also found that their pins were a pretty reasonable price. I know we can get, did I say pins? I also found that their pom-poms were a reasonable price. I know we can get pom-poms at a very wide variety of prices. At yarn shops versus on Etsy, somewhere else. I'm just sticking this right in the middle. You can see the pin right there. Okay, it's on. It seems it seems secure. Oh, that's fun. Look at that. And it's not, I thought it would maybe be a little more wobbly, but that's really secure. So now I can get sassy with my pink, but keep my sophisticated black cashmere. I just, I ruined my hat. Did I just ruin it? Did I just ruin my hat by adding a hot pink pom pom? Never. And then look, I just pop it off. And I can add the black one. Look, it's off already. Done. And then if I want to be more sophisticated. Oh my gosh, you guys, we can match our pom-poms to our outfits. That is next level. Here we go. <gasps> Cute. <gasps> Adorable. So there we go. This is the Pratt hat by Clinton Hill Cashmere. I'm sure you can use this pattern for other worsted weight yarns, but 
I do really like it in the cashmere. So thanks for stopping in. Happy knitting. Bye. Thank you.